And here is a look at our next competitor representing Azerbaijan, 15-year-old Sabina Alieva, second Junior Grand Prix season, second event for Sabina, 30th in Linz, 16th here after the short program, so that was a good finish. And she's going to need a 104.73 to take the lead. Season's best is 61.48. Hope for the personal best, one thing at a time. Sabina Ali Eva in her fourth performance of this year's Junior Grand Prix CDs. And I remember the skater last year as well. And she's capable of so much. And I thought the short program, a little bit of a turning point for her yesterday, able to deliver a little more successfully. But so many spaces where she seems to unknowingly and undesirably, I'm sure, throw away so much of the program in recovering from jumping elements. I don't know if you noticed at the beginning when they had a shot of her face, she heard something behind her. She turned her head. Distracted. Distracted, then came back and had a smile on her face. So I wonder if she was just not in the moment, mm. focused, right? And then once things started to go south a little bit, she started to throw herself a little bit more. There's the triple flip at the top of the program. Wasn't too bad, but too much on a lean to be able to stand up and breaking her body forward. 
Here's the triple Lutz, the second one. Gets that, stands up, and that's after like two falls, hard falls, and so that was a good comeback part of the program. A little bit later, the triple loop. She sort of double pumped on that, and mm. didn't snap in the rotation. And watch her get up here. You can see she's going, oh boy, this, yeah. is, this is tough. Because you're using a lot of energy getting up off the ice and fought back with a triple salsa. So she never gave up. She kept mm. fighting. This, I really appreciate, wasn't a great skate. It wasn't an easy skate and very physically demanding. Yes, and you know, last year she was 33rd year, but she's, and I saw the same scene. She's capable of so much. She can obviously do triple loop. She did triple loop yesterday, triple loop, double toe, double axle, but then had some problems with the spin, so it's just managing to get concrete concentration for the full. Well, it seems like when she, w she really wants it, as all skaters do, but for her, the trend, the transformation of wanting it is in muscling it. Mm. And this is where you need to use momentum and good timing and technique, make it simple, right? But as things started to go south, try it harder, try it harder, and of course, you know, that just doesn't work. I mean, trying hard is great, but you want to try hard in the right way, right? With the right mechanics. And yeah. You know, you almost sense that she wants to show the world what she's capable of, yeah, and then when exactly. it doesn't happen, the frustration is so very evident, and it's just channeling that frustration and not then having big gaping sections of the program where the components drop, because neither is the technical score going to be a reflection of her capabilities, but also the components won't be either as a result. And easier, easy for me to say, um, but you can see you, you, nobody wants to see the upset and Sabina in the kiss and cry. And, uh, we also just desperately hope that this young 15-year-old next year, as a 16-year-old, will be able to replicate. You can see just walking through the technique. Yeah, and you can see whether you know she's upset and you can see her desire is it's wonderful that's mm. wonderful but it's channeled into you know into trying harder which is great but this is where the coach is working trying harder doesn't mean necessarily more muscle mm. it means focus on the timing let the momentum that you've ga gathered through skating and it have that Efficient. explode you know, through timing so it's hard because you you, you look at the frustration in her face mm. and totally understand it strong enough 56.73, that is 15th in the free program, and with a 99.66, and that'll put Sabina currently 12th overall. And you have it there, you do. Just channel that energy and the strength that you have into the timing, into the technique, trust it.